Hi guys, welcome back to Guys With Guts. Today we're going to talk about guys with guns. We've got gun enthusiasts here with us, Rob McCallan. Hi Rob. How are you James? I'm doing pretty well, thanks. Thanks for coming on to the show today. We're going to talk about guns. So yes. So you love guns. Yeah, I have actually. Uh, excuse me, I do actually. It's, um, it's been a passion of mine for a long time. Uh, I was uh, introduced to, uh, to shooting with my father who was in the military for 25 years and I got to uh, go to the range with my dad and he was he was actually on the board of directors with the Lar Rodden Gun Club which was their local hunting and shooting club overseas at the base and as a boy of eight years old weighing nothing probably more than 60 70 pounds skinny little boy got to shoot a, a revolver for the first time and that's where that's where it started and it led to uh, hunting with my father and shooting with my dad for many years uh, and then we came back to uh, to Canada, where you know I, I I actually didn't ever go to the range again, but I picked up shooting a BB gun, and I still have that BB gun today. So shooting is itself uh, is 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 a is a sport, and people tend to often forget that. So we talk about guys with guns. We're not talking about guys with AR-15s. We're not talking about uh, military assault rifles. We're not talking about the U.S. and their uh, and sort of how they look look at guns. The United States views their the right to bear arms is the right for self-defense. Mm -hmm. In Canada, it is an awful lot different in terms of the mentality. The mentality is we want our, our, our rifles and our pistols to do sport action shooting or to do um, target shooting or to hunt with. Okay, that's a good point there. So what's the difference between the shooting and the hunting? Uh, big difference, actually. What you'll find is that most shooters aren't hunters and hunters are not necessarily shooters. So a shooter is somebody who will actively go on out and target shoot on a regular basis or on a semi-regular basis, uh, either with a handgun or with a rifle, a sighted-in rifle. Um, one of the main, most popular calibers is a 22 caliber, and in fact, it is the world's most popular caliber to shoot because it's cheap, very cheap, and the, the, and the, the, the firearms themselves are inexpensive and very accurate and a lot of fun. Um, I actually have three of them. One of them is pink for my daughters, and believe it or not, I have a pink camel 20, uh, 22 that they love to shoot. Fun. Uh, and uh, hunters, will typically only go on out maybe once a year, sight their rifle in, they're not sighted in at all, mm. and go bang, because they're only shooting one or two shots a year at, a, at an animal. They don't shoot 50 shots to kill an animal, hopefully. Yeah, that's true. Deer season, moose season, big game is what we're talking about, bear. Um, but if you shoot, of course, a small game on a regular basis, you're probably shooting a little bit more. But there is, there, there is a big difference between, between awesome. the two. So what is it about the shooting that you love? I, the discipline that I like to shoot is something called IPSC, I -P -S -C, which is Inter International Practical Shooting. And it is a combination of speed and accuracy, which means you have to be uh, relatively dexterous with your hands because you're moving back and forth with your hands to change your magazines. Uh, <clears throat> what I love about shooting in and of itself is how it really does sort of, it's a, it creates a zen-like feel. That was really neat. Then you'll see that. Yeah. When you shoot it for the first time, yeah. I'll try it. I want to try it. Oh, I can't Are you right-handed or left-handed? I'm uh, right-handed. Okay, come here. 